Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum my dear students. How are you? I hope you will be enjoying the best of health. I welcome you in my class that is an English for grade 5. We are learning unit number 7 over the counter medicine. Yes my dear teachers, I am going to deliver my lecture according to this lesson plan and this lesson plan is given into the description box. You may click it, download it or you can modify it for your convenience. Today is our lecture, lecture 8 writing skills today we will learn about writing skills before english for grade 4 we have already learned about punctuation i hope you remember it if you don't you may watch this video lecture again our today's learning outcomes are write sentences of their own using correct capitalization punctuation and spelling yes Pre reading questions are there. What do you know about punctuation? Pause the video and respond to your teacher and then come back. Yes, I hope you have done it. Good job. What is punctuation? Punctuation is the use of symbols such as full stops or periods, commas or question marks to divide written words into meaningful sense. Yes, my dear students, what are punctuation? Punctuation is the use of symbols. We use different symbols in our writing that such as full stops, question marks, apostrophe and many punctuation marks are there to create a meaningful sense in our paragraph, in our sentence. Without these punctuation, our paragraphs, our sentences are meaningless and we cannot understand the sense of that these sentences. Let us see which are there. What is the function of these symbols? These marks clarify sentences and meaning of different texts. We also have to capitalize the first letter of a sentence, names of people and places. Yes, what is the function of these symbols? Here we can get that these symbols clarify the sentence. We can get the actual sense of that sentence with these symbols and also as we know that we have to capitalize the first letter of a sentence, name of people, name of places. So, we have to capitalize the first letter of the sentence. This is also a way of punctuation. Yes, which marks are there? There are there exclamation marks that marks we use when we show our sudden feelings and sudden expressions. We like wow, so beautiful. So, we use such type of marks. Full stop we use at the end of the sentence that is a like declarative sentence. We can use simple sentence at the end of the sentence we use full stop. And comma we use, there is a comma and we use comma when we have to show a series of items then we use comma. Question mark, we use question mark when we ask a question. Colon, we use colon when we are going to mention a series of things like these are the following materials. Then we use comma and we give these things. Quotation marks, we use quotation marks when we have to quote the exact and actual words of the speaker, then we give quotation marks. Yes, open book page number 10 and page number 68, question number 10, have a look at the given conversation between a doctor and a patient and try to reproduce a dialogue while highlighting some comic issue. Yes, my dear students, here is a dialogue for you between patient and a doctor. So, read it and try to judge it what they are discussing about. Yes, my dear students, I hope you have done it. Good job. So, let us perform a activity to learn more about punctuation. Write a topic myself on the whiteboard. Make pair of students and call them in front of class. One student will write a question on the board and the other 
partner will write its answer with correct capitalization and punctuation. Teacher will write topic on the board myself and student will come in the shape of pair. One student will write question, suppose what's your name, how are you, what, what you are going to do in such type of question. One student will write question and the other partner will write answer. Engage whole class in this activity to give them strong concept of punctuation in the shape of a dialogue. And that's it. We know that the dialogue is a conversation between two persons. So then they can get that and what is actual way to pronounce, to weigh and the punctuate the sentence. Engage whole class in the activity and perform that activity in your class. Yes, I hope you have enjoyed it. Good job. What's our homework? Write 10 sentences using correct capitalization and punctuation in your notebook. Yes, this is worksheet and you may click it and provide it to your students in printed form. So, wrap up what we have covered today. Today we have covered the use of correct capitalization, punctuation and spelling in a dialogue. And in this way we have covered up our SLO right sentences of their own using correct capitalization, punctuation and spelling and we have done it. Yes, my dear students, so today we have completed our lecture. So, let us hope to meet again. Thank you. Allah peace.